Skip what I'm talking about. Let's get to it. Ooh, what? Monster Hunter Rise Sunbreak. All right, so Monster Hunter Rise has a brand new DLC coming. That's super exciting. Even though I've never played Monster Hunter Rise before in my life. That's what's up. <laughs> What's going on everybody? My name is AO Runny and I am back with yet another video. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and strike that like, subscribe to join the tribe, and suggest what AO Runny should do next. Let's get to it. So we started off kind of with a bang. I wasn't really expecting that, but we have Monster Hunter Rise, brand new DLC starting. I think a lot of people were expecting the final Smash character to be information in the revealed. I definitely 100% right. was. Batch of Nintendo Switch headlines. Okay, there we go. So that was just a trailer. Now we're getting to it. It's almost time to party. Yeah, looking in forward the Mario to this. Party Absolutely. Superstars game. Along with Spaceland and Peach's birthday cake, several other boards make their return. Okay, Only so this is something we already knew about. To be clear, the longest this is basically survival. a brand new Super we'll Mario Party on the Switch. But they're taking a bunch of the old Not boards and bringing it to fruition in the new game. So mixed feelings about this one, but still looking player. forward to it because Mario Party so games family, are friends, super fun. Mario Party Superstars launches on the Nintendo Switch system October 29th. Okay, we got a concrete date. Are available now on what else comes out that day? Um, Something else, something else. Riders RPG Republic comes out that cards. day. RPG and the cards. Welcome to Voice of Cards. So the Eyeball Trio sets out on the Queen's quest to slay the dragon. A reckless young man who fancies himself a hero carries yet only a card. His traveling companion, a quiet monster, and a proud witch, her hatred for the dragon all consuming. The Queen's behest, Square Enix, voice of the card. On a fantastical journey to slay mm. the fearsome dragon for honor and fortune. Everything in this realm is represented as cards. I see. From the protagonists to shops, towns. It's kind of a head scratcher. Environments. In this fresh take on tabletop RPG. Tabletop RPG. This looks like a game I would definitely play, but not for an audience. If this is something you guys want to see, if they do a demo on a Switch, I'll definitely play it. Minds of Yoko Taro and Yosuke Saito is about to unfold. But this isn't going to have like audience retention. Nobody's going to really want to see this game. Maybe to kind of get strategies. The Isle Dragon this will be a good how to on game. Nintendo Switch October 28th. Pre orders and a free demo will be available. Free demo! Hey, the let's show. get it! I want to play it. I'm going to check it out. Maybe I'll drop that tomorrow. If you guys could you see how I'm sitting, you would think I was a Abishan, weirdo. Devoid of your memories. Soon, you learn mm. that you're a detective and get into Disco Asylum. A murder case in the groundbreaking role playing adventure Disco Elysium. The final Elysium, cut. sorry. Be I don't really like these top down Disco games. Elysium, let me know. Cut launches digital. I don't, something Nintendo about it. I don't like October top 12. down games. The physical version of but if you like it, let me know in the comments. Pre orders. Disco the Asylum, the final cut. I'm not hip shop. to this genre. If you are, let me know. I want to know what I'm missing Uncover out on. More stories in Hyrule Ooh, Warriors, Age of there we go. That's something. Obviously, a lot of people are expecting more Zelda news. Hopefully, this isn't all you guys get. I, I, I know. I know. People are going to be mad if we don't hear anything about uh, BOTW2. I'm sorry if I don't have much of a reaction to this. I've actually never played Hyrule Warriors. So, please forgive me. I know somebody's going to attack me. I'm trying to see what the heck I'm looking at. Wave 2, Guardian Remembrance. Oh, Oh snap! <laughs> People are gonna hate that I have a, a better reaction for chocobos in Zelda. Final Fantasy characters like Chocobo and Gilgamesh. Gilgamesh. If you've ever known me, you know I reference Gilgamesh all the time. Using drift boost to cut. This is gonna be so much fun. Magical stones called magicites are contained inside items. Collect these throughout courses to cast magic like fire and arrow to blast Definitely looking opponents. forward to that doom. Acquire magicites of the same element to cast even more. That looks spells. entirely too much fun. I can't wait for this. Hopefully, well, this is all Each racer winter time release ability. or winter time coverage. Right time so maybe we're looking at March for this. We'll see what they're Engine talking customization about. Customization options will be available as well as local and online multiplayer. 
locally or online. That's what's up. Thank God. Up to 64 players oh. can compete in a bracket style. Hey, that sounds like so game. much fun. Chocobo GP races exclusively on Nintendo Switch. I knew we Switch weren't going to get an actual year. release date, but I'm very happy to see that. I knew it. I knew it was coming. Let's see, guys. Am I going to be a rich man? Because I... Mr. Sakurai, the game's director, will reveal this fighter in the final Mr. Sakurai Presents video on October 5th. Are you serious? He'll also they had to make it that big of a deal? Fighter, so please look forward to it. That's kind of bogus, bro. October 5th, 7 a.m. That's now, pretty lame. Please. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. That's kind of irritating. All right, guys. What do you think we're looking at here? Somebody already knows. I don't. I'm sorry. I don't know every single video game franchise in the world. What are we looking at? Is this Kingdom Hearts? If this is Kingdom Hearts related, though, I'm going to go insane. Nope. Kirby related. Somebody I know. Somebody. Shout out to them. They know who they are. Somebody's going insane right now looking at Kirby. I mean, Kirby fan 64? Maybe. Maybe. Are we looking at a new Kirby adventure? Yes, we are. Kirby in the Forgotten Land. All right, I rocks with Kerbs. Not going to say he's like my go-to character. But I'm not mad at dude. This looks like a calm, peaceful adventure. A little 2D, 3D platformer. That looks like fun. I want to see some more gameplay though. Like, show me some gameplay. Okay, I give it. I wish for. Whoa, definitely looks like fun. Not gonna lie, unless it's Final Fantasy, I'm not the biggest fan of one-person adventures. I'm not gonna lie. I'm never gonna lie. I'm not the biggest fan of one-person adventure games. Multiplayer adventure games, like it takes two style. Count me in. But so far, this looks pretty epic. Kirby in the Forgotten Land. That's definitely a good, looks like a good Switch port. You know what I mean? Something that'd be fun to actually play on the Switch. Undock. Spring 22. Spring 2022. Nah, not bad. Next. What you got, baby? Soft pianos. I'm already feeling. Oh, <gasps> Animal Crossing. The roost open 24 7. If that was it, I'm gonna be mad salty. Animal Crossing Direct airing in October. They are on a roll with the, the trolls today, dude. They are the trolling the heck out of everybody. Has been enjoyed by many so we've got a Smash character. That isn't coming out soon. Content we, have, in <laughs> we have Animal Crossing in that they won't tell us about. October's like next week, detail. bro. So we got two announcements where they didn't Please announce anything. Look out for the air date of this presentation. But that's fine. I really need to work on my island. <laughs> Let's move on to more. Hey! More free content is coming to the Mario I still Golf never beat story game. mode on this game. Koopa Troopa enters the fairway okay. as a playable character. I salute that. Ninja hey, that dude looks dope. Take advantage of Ninji's blinding speed to outpace opponents. All right, let's talk about the courses. Let so me know in the comments if you've got added. that Mario Golf. I like. I want to play live with somebody. These additions will come swinging in as a free software update later. Score. Today. We got a score. For the record, I only know one other person that has that game. An invitation. Oh. oh. You're invited to live in a magical world. Disney, man. Oh, I thought this was Kingdom Hearts, bro. Characters. I was about to go crazy. Man, I might play, play that for real. <laughs> I'm a huge Disney All fan. Oh. Disney magical World 2 Enchanted Edition. Source onto Nintendo Switch. Oh, this, this is a port? Never mind. 
I'm of so the tired of poor Star Wars game is coming to Nintendo Switch. Blast off to captivating planets and join forces with Jedi. I say ugh, because that game, outfit. I don't know, their characters look kind of action, boxy. Playing and adventure. I'm just saying, will first you impression. Use the force for good, or will you be lured to the dark side? I want a new Star Your Wars game. I know somebody's going crazy for that. today on Nintendo eShop. But I've literally only played one Star Wars game, and I've There's one thing you always, always remember, remember: stay human. Stay human. Is this like Detroit? Stay human. This is the city. Detroit Humanity's become last human. Stronghold against a virus that turns people nope. into the undead. In the cloud version of Dying Light 2, Stay Human, you'll need to master both parkour and tactical cloud to version in this brutal open world action RPG. That looks explore alone or with up to three other players in online. Ooh, co as you see, the that's that's what I'm talking about during the day. Then plunder the layers of the infected. Is this an original Your game or a port? Dying Light 2, Stay Human cloud version launches on mm -hmm. nintendo switch february 4th all right so we got some time to gather some information will also launch the same day on nintendo eShop. dying light Wait, what? platinum edition comes to nintendo switch october 9th when they say the same day pre-orders begin today on nintendo eShop. when they say same day does that mean now Utility, okay this is something i've been looking forward to liberty it's a Square Enix in game. Triangle Strategy, a fiery chronicle of war. So is that the name? Stunning. That's a terrible name. This is basically a new Final Fantasy tactic. story that changes. But it's not Final Fantasy. I love, love, love these kinds of games. Bro. I cannot follow. <laughs> I bet. Improvements to on-screen visuals. Yeah. Camera angle control. Yes. The ability to review previous. I played dialogue. that demo too. And streamlined game flow and loading times. Loading times are important. More details are now available on Nintendo.com. So is that the official name? Blended. It's Triangle Strategy. Triangle Strategy will launch on Nintendo Switch March 4th, right. 2022. That sounds like a Dolo experience. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo. Well, we got a lot of time. A lot of time before that comes out. Oh, there we go. For all the people that got mad last time in my Metroid Dread <laughs> reaction. I'm sorry, it's still 2D. I'm going to play it, and I'm going to play it on this channel. But I'm still not hip to the franchise, and Nintendo does a bad job of releasing games that people can actually play to get familiar with the franchise. That's the truth. So I want to walk into this honestly as blind as possible. Because I want to get to know this game. I really do. And I want to enjoy this game. So I'm not going to have like a big reaction because I'm not trying to really absorb too much about this game. I mean, it looks dope. It looks like fun. But I want to be surprised. I've heard a lot of good things about this franchise, but I want to be surprised when I play it. So I don't want to know that much. Samus Aran, the most powerful bounty hunter in the galaxy, mm -hmm. embarks on a new mission to the uncharted planet ZDR. Her objectives? Confirm whether the deadly x I... <laughs> still exists, <laughs> and figure out why the Emmy research robots in search of it have mysteriously... I was about to say, dark. Samus kind of looks like a girl. But I guess they just, uh... They just proved me right. Hey. Detailed account of the terrain and life forms you may encounter in the That's some real Dread fanfare game. right there. Be sure to view the other Metroid Dread reports there as I know well. for sure. You want to prepare yourself for the dangers that lie That ahead. comes out October 8th. Metroid Dread launches on Nintendo Switch October I'm I'm waiting for it. Available I want it Nintendo to be good. E and I want to be surprised God, when I play it. Up next, we have news about Nintendo Switch. We're at the halfway mark. Uh oh. Many people have been. Using We're at the halfway Nintendo mark, Switch guys. Since it launched in September 2018. In addition to the current membership, we'll be adding a new membership plan. Oh, of course, more money. I'm sorry, I don't care about how much money, but I'm saying. Content. Legend of Zelda: Ocarina of Time. You'll be able to play oh, why a they cut the of music Nintendo 64. <gasps> they actually did it, bro. The Nintendo 64. There you go. 25. There you ago. go. 
I think this they did the right thing. Players their first 3D gaming experiences, as well as intense four-player multiplayer. They action. did the right thing. With Nintendo Switch, up to four people can play select Nintendo 64 games locally or online. Shout out to everybody who wanted that. How much also, is it? This new membership That's plan. what I want to know. In addition to the Nintendo 64 games, Sega. Are you serious? Hey! You can play a collection. We of knew games it was coming, Sega bro. System. Sega's in such a bad position, bro. It's not even funny. Oh my God! Means, Streets of Rage. How much, bro? I'm not even joking. As well as the ability to play the included Nintendo 64 and Genesis. Like if it's an extra ten, that's cool. This is Nintendo Switch Online plus expansion. Pack. If it's more than that, I don't know. This new membership plan will be added in late October. Okay. In case you guys are wondering, my calendar's up of there. Course, that's why I always look up. Just tell us how much, bro. We'll share more details about this new membership plan at a later time, including the exact release date and pricing. Info. It seems so half baked. For now, however, when they we'd like to announce when the they don't have a price to launches. give you. All right, so we got Mario 64. We'll that's cool. Yoshi Story, Doctor Mario 64, Win Back. So for Genesis, we got Golden well Axe. Oh my God, I love that game. Sonic 2, Shinobi 3, we'll that's good. Good collection. Good collection. The Legend of Zelda, Majora's Mask, and F Zero X, as well as other Nintendo 64. And Mario, Genesis Pokemon, the original Zelda Pokemon Zelda. Snap, okay. Kirby 64, Paper Mario. I've never even played Paper Mario. Banjo Kazooie, I love those guys. That's what's up. Good moves. Both can be used wirelessly. Very good moves. These controllers will be available oh. for purchase by the Nintendo Switch online member. Not bad. I hope you'll look forward to this new membership plan. I do. Nintendo Switch Online plus How much? Pack. I'm willing to toss an extra Let's 10. Let's more Nintendo Switch headlines. Maybe $50 per year. There's plenty <laughs> in these collections. More than that, you guys are tripping. You know it's going to be like $50 a year. Uh, 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 I have no idea what we're looking at. But the beat is hard. Something. I'm, I can't freestyle right now. I'm trying to listen. Combat await in Shadowrun Trilogy. Launching on Nintendo Switch next year. Anybody excited for that? The perpetual struggle against Count Dracula continues. Castlevania Advance Collection hey. brings together four classic Castlevania About games, time. Very nice. Castlevania Advance Collection launches on Nintendo Switch later today. What? Dee! Shadow classic Drops. Returns. Almighty Classic. Why does this sound so familiar? The classic Super NES game Act Razor returns on Nintendo Switch, now remastered in HD. It sounds As familiar. Lord of Light Never played Almighty this. Almighty God, only you can save mankind from the forces of Tanzra, the Lord. Somebody's of God. having a heart attack You'll right now, but I have phases. no idea what I'm First, looking at. Strike the monsters. <laughs> that actually it's looks up fun. It's you to decide which structures will be destroyed to make way for new ones, creating a wow. flourishing civilization. Act Razor Renaissance descends onto Nintendo Switch later today. Oh, grrr, there that is. Don't know what I looked at. New chapter at. is about to unfold. Delta Room. Not hip. I've seen a couple YouTubers start to play it. If anybody thinks that I should play that game too, let me know. I see them play it, but I don't see like a lot of fanfare for it. I don't see a lot of people asking for Delta Room. But if it's like a cool game, I got no problem playing it. But for the record, I've seen people play it. But I've never actually watched the videos. Chapter 1 and 2. Available. Ooh, oh, I thought it said available for free. Is that's If it's faux free, then it's faux me. You already know. What are we looking at? We got a montage, everybody. Hot Wheels Unleashed. Good for you guys. Paradox Interactive, Surviving the Aftermath. Okay. Digital pre-orders begin today. Why is this in a montage? The fanfare for that game is unreal. I can't wait to play Shin Metsugami, whatever it's called. Shin Tetsugami. I'm definitely going to play that. Pac-Man. 
Ah, this beat though. Room Factory 5, March 22nd, 2022. Nice little montage. I wish they talked How about Shin Metsugami though. There are still a few more announcements. In yes, sir. We are now direction. 25 minutes in. <laughs> I also wanted to reveal our key cast members who will be facing Mario. <laughs> no, I don't want to hear about this. I want to hear about video games. First, of course, is Mario. Okay. I'm gonna just not listen to this. So Anyways, cool. I don't. Mario was I, talking a lot in the movie. They brought Please out a Mario Super Mario Brothers movie like 20 something years ago. I was like four when that game came out, when that movie came out. It's an okay game, but I've never been a fan of uh, video games that were turned into movies. So with all due respect, I'm going to be leaving this part out of the reaction. And we're going to talk about video games because that's what I do. Unless it's a Spider-Man movie. Cut. I mean, not cut. Next. Okay, we do have <laughs> Seth Rogen playing Donkey Kong, so I'm looking forward to that. Hey, there we go. Splatoon 3 will be live on this channel when it comes out. I don't care what day it is. Even if it's a Sunday or a Tuesday, we're going to be playing this game on this channel. Oh, look at that. This is a game I can actually keep up with and understand what's going on. Even though I'm trash at it, bro. Level 17, get at me. I think I'm actually level 16. What is this ninja-ness that's going on? Okay, we got the umbrella back. You're going too fast. What are those little bubble things? We got game plans. Release date. Give us a release date. We can't wait. 33% of everybody want the news on this game. Bro, this is looking dope, though. I'm not going to say anything about the graphics because it's Nintendo Switch, and we already know what the graphics is going to look like. So let's just not talk about graphics. Let's just talk about guns and abilities and just leave it at that. In story mode or lack thereof, I don't want an expansion pass to start. I want like a real story mode. It's all I want. And I want to have fun with my friends. That's it. Release date, please. What is that? Return of the Mammalians. I'm not hip to Splatoon 1. I only know Splatoon 2. Somebody let me know what that is in the comment. What? Hello. We got a researcher. Splatoon 3 takes Just give me a release date, bro. Splatsville? The city of chaos. Okay. Centered around Splatsville. That looks so cool, bro. Long inhabited by advanced sea creatures such as squids and octopuses. Okay. Buildings spanning several generations are crammed into the city creating its distinctive culture. I'm not going to say what, what city I'm thinking of. Appears to be a popular activity. Yes. Its basic rules. Wow, they float. That's cool. Two four player teams compete against each other to ink the most. Give us five versus five or I'm never However, playing again. Return of the mammalian. OK, meaning the reappearance of mammals appears to be the theme of story mode. This time. All right. What could this possibly mean in a world where all mammals, except for two cats, have vanished? What? It appears that there's still a lot to uncover. Is the mammalians, is that a new thing? I don't know, Splatoon lore, bro. I just know I have fun. Updated ...once more results become available. Release date. Please look forward to more. Splatoon 3. Release date. Release date. Updates to come. See you next Bro, time. this is the most troll trolling Nintendo Direct ever. It's scheduled to release in 2022. Please look forward to future updates. 
Okay, this is the last trailer we have to show you today. Please take a look. 636, yo. This don't look like Zelda. <laughs> Rin Tin Tin? Please don't be like Call of Duty or something like that, yo. Very little idea what I'm looking at, guys. I'm not gonna lie. What is this, Ninjago? Ninjala? Oh. <laughs> oh my god, you're six years late, bro. If this is what I think it is, bro. Yeah, you're like six years late. I wish I had the chat turned on, bro. Let me get a, a, a pick for the thumbnail, bro. There we go. Release date. Can I get an actual release date? Because they said this is going to be about... It should be fourth and first quarter, and I don't think we got a real release date on anything. Like, we got release dates on a bunch of ports, and that's it. And that's good that we have trailers, but they've been working on this game for six months. So, where's the game, bro? Pay another three. You already know. If they don't give me a release date, bro, I'm not even going to close out this video. <laughs> yes, I am. Nintendo, don't waste my freaking time like this again. No, I'm just playing. But man, come on. They didn't give us any real release dates. Just release dates for ports, bro. Right, you All right, I'm not going to lie. I, I'm pretty disappointed in this. Um, they reveal Splatoon 2. No release date. Bayonetta 3. No release date. Animal Crossing update. No release date. But we do have an Animal Crossing Direct coming. Uh, no Pokemon news, which we all know is 50-50. So can't really complain about that. And then there was the new Smash character. They'll tell us about that in a week. So it's just like kind of like, what if we just watch this showcase? Oh, so you can tell us that we got Nintendo 64 and Sega on the way. No release date. However, if you guys like this video and my reactions, you already know what to do. <laughs> Let me know in the comments how you felt about this Nintendo Direct. It's good to see some footage for Splatoon 3. That was probably one of the most awesome things here uh project triangle strategy is now project or just triangle strategy so yeah and then like some side scrolling games i'm gonna have to rewatch this and really digest what i just witnessed but i don't really feel like i saw much i feel like it was a very fast 40 minutes of uh pretty much just trailers but no real it was all style, no substance. So not a big fan of this direct, but there's definitely some things to talk about. Let me know in the comments things you're excited about. We do have a new Kirby game. And guess what? That's coming in 2020. <laughs> in the meantime, if you like this reaction and you want to see more like it, you already know what to do. Go ahead and hit the strike on that like. Subscribe to join the tribe. Let me know in the comments what you want to see me do next. I'm going to see you guys in the next one. Bye.